Hey guys, hey, in this video, we're gonna talk about, we're gonna talk about chipping and pitching. Now, the chip is shorter than the pitch. You know, when you're talking about chipping, you're talking about chipping maybe 10, 15 yards. When you talk about a pitch, you're talking about pitching at maybe 25, 30 yards, okay? But it's the same motion. It's the same, it's the same, uh, the same move. Now, I'm gonna give you a down the line view right quick, or right off the bat, a down the line view. On my posture, when I set up, I'm a little open to the target, which means my left foot, my left foot is kind of flaring out. I'm not square. My left foot's kind of flaring out, and I'm putting more weight on that left foot, okay? Because again, I want to feel balanced. I want to feel loose. This is not a, it's not a tense swing, okay? So, I'm kind of balanced. I'm set up, more weight on my left foot, and now when I set the club down, I'm not going to turn the club. I'm not going to grab underneath and turn. I'm going to set this 58 down right at 58. Ball's going to be a little bit forward of my stance. Okay. And now I have the spine centered posture. More weight, more pressure. My head's back a little bit. And now I can still what? Create space and hit through the ball. Okay. Now let's look at that from down the line. Down the line is the same way. Open to the target nice and balanced. When I take the club back, the club tracks on the outside of the plane. It, it, when I'm, well, it tracks right on the plane, swing plane, right here. I'm not trying to go out. I'm not trying to come in. When I come out on the plane, my wrist, they rotate horizontally. I don't come off the ball and then immediately try to hinge the wrist. Okay, they, rinse, they hinge horizontally. Because here's one of the questions I ask the guys. When you see my wrist in this position here, do you think the wrist is hinged or not? And a lot of guys say, no, it hasn't hinged. But it has hinged because if it hadn't hinged off the ball, my wrist would look like this. But I showed you this. So it's hinged this much, but it's a horizontal hinge. And it's that horizontal hinge that enables you to just what? Kind of sweep through the ball. Okay, just, it helps you just kind of sweep through the ball. So as I'm hitting this ball here, I can kind of sweep through it, okay, and get the ball up and get it to check right there. It's the horizontal hinge that gets me to get through the ball. Okay, now in the next video, I'm gonna talk about how we come through impact and what the feeling is as we rotate through the ball. Okay, watch this video as many times as you need to. Talk to you soon.